And now welcome back once more to the wonderful world of Planet Crafter. Ain't they pretty our little butterflies? -y? But they are quite inefficient in here, so I'm gonna switch them out for the outside farms. Because, well, efficiency is everything for me, you know me. Has to be efficient or it doesn't work. If you do have things quick enough, you can do them in my inventory that I already prepared. Today's expedition. Whee! Looks nice that we got even more. I got three new lockers. Don't need the flashlight anymore. Larvae, fertilizer, mutagen. We got some rare. We got three rare larvae and two ultimates, so we need one, two, three, four fertilizers. One, two, three, four mutagens. It's quite good that I had a nice stockpile of sulfur and eggplant and all the kind of stuff lying around. Time for some genetic gambling. I wonder. Well, alright. So we don't know what we get, even though we already know one or two outcomes. So this can either be a B or a silkworm. In the meantime, while I was running around, I unlocked the silkworm, uh, the silk generator, not the silkworm generator, and it's free silkworm. So I need a lot of uncommon, uncommon stuff build anything. Excuse me. I got pneumonia and then I'm still getting my regular coughing fits. So in my inventory I got a base, a door and a teleporter. In the meantime I also built one more fusion generator on the roof of my way too overloading main building. But yeah. It did well so far so why, why do it? I already planted some more mushrooms because of the bio nuggets. Since the most efficient way would be the butterfly farm, and we, as far as I know, there are 15 insects. So it may be 14 butterflies and the bees. Which means, even if we use the dough for the. Let's not call it worse, but the. The lowest efficient butterflies. Ooh, hello, you're a new one. Oh, I did. You rare ones. Which one are you? You are. The Penga butterfly. Oh, yeah, this. Let's see, maybe we can get a silkworm. Which we Since I don't have any more farms already, I just... Ooh. You look way more yellow once you're outside of the cage. But that's the blue filter for you. 20 seconds of coughing fits later. What will it be? Show me the bee. Aww. Kinda was wishing for the silkworm. But it turns out I already managed three fertilizers. We need fertilizer up here too. So all I need now are some pre-prepared bio nuggets. I blew them to the map. I have a nugget building over there, but I need it now here, so I kind of need to move the nuggets. Which brings me to one. Can we create our first batch of honeybee? Honey beans it is. It will help me on my great and long journey through the old areas and the new ones. Maybe I should have started the research. Great. Greatly. I'm a big brainy boy, I am dying. Ooh, high quality food. High quality food. Ho 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 ho. 31%. Let us. 
That's what you get for disabling your hub. You die of thirst. Oh, the algaes, they are growing so fast, you can... The only limiting factor is how many eggplant generators you got, and I got a lot of eggplant. And since the quality of life update last time, where we don't have to replant everything from hand, if we want to grow the same thing over and over, Everything's coming up. Well, not really Jesse because I'm not Jesse. Ooh, way. Oh, we got you already. All right, one more try. I mean, those are really good butterflies. I mean, there's just one type higher, but I was really hoping for Lixio or Chevron. Oh well. Oh no, yes. One over here. Whoop. 225 grams of insect per second. If this was true, this would... And once again, I didn't start. This would solve our food crisis. Well... I... You can... You, in fact, you can check or chitin, whatever you want to call it. Ooh, we are already halfway through. That's nice. Ooh, that's new. That's also nice. All those three together are now what was biomass at first. Now it's plants and insects. However, since we are got so many plants, there will be an editor for animals, but that's in the future. I mean, those two two people doing this game, they are doing a fabulous, amazing job. It's <laughs> so good. What did I do wrong this time? No bad luck. Another duplicate. You know what? For now, you can stay inside. I know there's a one outside, but we get enough. Now, enough jibber jabber. I think it is time. Pop up. It's time for the exploration part. The path I want to take is through the tears of the mountain. In, on the meantime, keeping an eye out for some uncommon butterfly larvae because I need. Silkworms, that's the main reason I want to leave. The other butterflies would be interesting, but... Ooh, oh, this looks amazing. Changed some of the lighting again. Oh, some ferns are growing inside. This is gorgeous. Oh yeah, I hit some heaters here. Now, since there are white, white butterflies, wild butterflies, I think I should see them from quite a ways away. This plateau screams hidden. Oh, oh, it's you know, it could be insects. They're insect-eating plants, so why not? And I wish I had waited a little bit until there was daylight. You know what? By the power of editing, this is now morning. And still, aside from a few dust modes and larvae, no butterflies up top. Oh well, especially with the insect luring meat-eating, flesh-eating plants, I thought it would be nice, but oh well. Oh. Ah! 
Well, that was stupid. Don't break. Ow! Don't break a leg. Oh, alright. I'm gonna take the teleporter towards the park bowl. Welcome to the park bowl. I don't have a space scanner around here. So, back there is the Tears of the Mountain. And I wanna take the. Well, the beautiful way around through the Osmium Caves. And now the floor here is kinda greenish yellow, not just purely yellow. Let us see. Sulfur. I thought maybe there was another type of larvae, but I think it's those three the common, the uncommon, and then the rare one. I don't know if they only spawn near the player, so as not to overwhelm the game. So if I am running around too fast, I might miss some, but oh well. Ooh, uncommon one. That's the one I want. Yeah, burns grass even in the Osmium Cave. And in the plains of Zeolitis, which got a flooding. My little miner got flooded, but oh well. Could have been worse, could have been me. Alright, but you also don't have a terminal for me to peek through the skies. Alright, hang on back. No, there's a way out towards the Iridium Crater, where our friend, whose name I already forgotten, has built his base and wanted to escape from this hellhole of a planet. His, well, sadly diseased remains can be found close to our base, but that was in another episode and I will not go back there yet. So what do we have here? Oh, at least here. Oh, much. Another wreck, one of the tree planters I spread around the entire map just to cover more areas. This all seems to be normal, nothing new. No butterflies flipping around so far. Maybe they are rather down by the stargate that fell from the sky. That looked like it had some natural growth. Let's take a look at the, the blood falls because I saw them while it was getting dark and the sand poles create an amazing red mist effect of ripping down blood. Ooh, jetpack travel, you are so great. It may also be possible that I am too fast. So if I find not a single Wild butterfly. Let's see, maybe near landmarks like the crest ship. The cones, the uranium cave that I found last time, finally. Oh no, it was the time before, it was before the update. I finally found the uranium in the caves down there. It was shown from the satellite with, via the resource monitor, but I couldn't see anything. Oh, I got wormies, common one, so no thank you. Dark orange or light orange with a black tip, that's the one we want. How about cave butterflies? Bat of lies. Yes, 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 I know, I know, I know, I know. 
I was trying to conserve my. Can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? Warning. Yes, 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 yes. Please be on the. Ooh, that was close. Alright, nothing new at the corner of the map. Hold it. I can move it. I think those are planted by me, but we head down over towards the sea trip, but have a small... Oh, there's no teleporter. Darn it. I was gonna say, I'm gonna have a small detour into the Temple of Doom. For that, they have to wait until I find another teleporter. But there's some plants over there. Let's zoom on over. Ooh, I can see a little bit of uranium between the cracks. Yeah, I think those are planted by me. Yeah. World building is way too good to allow this sort of nonsense. This happens when a player messes around with the terraforming progress. Oh well. I think I'm gonna do a cut and just bring you back if there's actually something to see because this takes quite a while. This play box unlocked, which means we now got a ton of insects in the world. Haven't found anything even around those plants. I mean, it takes a little if you stand around a bit. There appears to be more larvae spawning, but I spent about five to six minutes around. One of those wild plants in a green area, but nothing happens. Let's try Aladdin's Jewel Cave and go down into the canyon. Somewhere meteors are coming down, but I think the blue ones were the Osmium, so... Not a new one. Any more storm butterflies coming up? Looks kind of nice up on the plateaus. There is always the possibility that now for the first time a, we are not safe game compatible and you need an actual new world to get these spawn points for insects. But what? Ow, my ankle. Alright, what are you? Osmium. I see a lot of cobalt. I don't think they are in storage chests. Oh, it, it could be possible. Also, what's possible is that they are in the in the new areas, and the new areas are kinda like a automatic. I'm coming, and you are underwater, so I can take you. Look at that, let's see the Stargate. I'm also not quite sure how it would work, because our butterflies can only fly around when they are inside of something, so... Is there another delivery of... find anything in the last one aside from a and I don't see anything maybe this one does not work or it's the I don't know That's, I have to mine this one oh well who knows it's a meteorite meteorites are always fun as long as they don't land on your are you okay. As long as they don't land on your head. Oh. Now I've lost my way. Alright, there's my little cubby hole. Which means down there are the three little indentures with the uranium mine. And I'm pretty sure this one has a a space satellite uplink so I can take a look around. Looks like the raining season had come to my little cubby holes. So that's the one with the satellite in it. 
and this one should be the uranium mine or is it let's see oh no that's the the bunker of our friend who's now dead oh so much water again oh no just dust storm oh like my light isn't hard enough Amazing as always. However, there should be a hidey hole for me around here. Namely from the uranium mine. How did I miss it? Alright, so now I am... Um, so this was the crater? Uranium mine is still there. I just... I don't know. I missed it. That's my little cubby hole, and then I go down to the uranium. So now we are here in the fields. There's the underground base. This is where we are right now. And this is definitely new. And so we go and go out and take a look. I also refresh my oxygen supply a a little bit more because I like to breathe. Let's go over the horizon. The new color scheme. Oh! Oh! Ooh, glowy rocks. Also, glowy rocks. New gem. Always nice. Oh. Oh, yes. Natural pulsar quartz. So maybe just ma no, it would have told me. If I were to slap down a tier two mining thingamajig, I think it would have told me rockets. Nice. Oh, nice. Hmm. Well, it looks like it's. Falling slower and you see stars around. Ooh, the atmosphere in this game is just bloody amazing. Mm, let's actually begin a little bit monochromatic around here. Oh! Oh! Well. Well, it's the first day of the update. I mean, more collision problems are bound to be expected, although those are quite severe. Which makes you wonder and hope that you don't fall between the cracks of the world. And I'll look around the edges. There's quite a few blue crates. But nothing that comes... Whoa! Wait, what? Nothing that comes close to... Ooh, it's getting bright again. To some new... butterflies. Or do I have to have them outside in the farm and then the time they... Recreate, repopulate, recombopulate. What do we got here? You look kind of. No. What I'm guessing over here, there's the. Yeah, there's the old outpost. Can it be that there's something inside now that they managed to. You know, that there's a. But in the bases, they got some of those butterfly. Oh, there then. That wasn't the name. But they are able to build. So may maybe, maybe they had some sort of. 
butterfly growing program, insect growing program that they had access to, but we have not. So they came with different species to the planet. This is the crafter, this is the lunacy, and that's the hidden room. Yeah, also nothing here. Let's go back to the new area. This is still just an absolutely gorgeous area. However, I could not find anything other than, you know, the usual loads of advanced materials that give you quite a kickstart in your going campaign. I mean, there's pulse crystals for at least two teleporters and a fusion reactor lying around there. And now we have another amazing new feature, a waterfall. So probably a... My own light blinding me. This place looks amazing. And the ideal spot to... Where have I lost my s Oh, I went from running around either. Close to home and threw it away. Alright, let me get some. There was some over there in the meteorite star shining space area. Or well, maybe we can see a grown root arch around here. Yes, no, no, alright. Secret teleporter room has been filled. And now, what's this? Something. It's just a rock. A drinking rock. Oh, a space peak. Oh, Can I see something? No. Not really an RPG, but there has to be something. A cave. A cave hidden behind the waterfall. It has to be there. So I rounded it. Oh yeah, it's the quartz. Man, that one is loud. Can you hear me? A meteor is coming. You have to duck and cover. Well. Oh, 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 oh. Let me see. I was thinking this quartz is not for me because, well. I didn't found a root up there, so I guess it's time to collect a whole lot of iron. Probably by a teleporter. And build a stairway to heaven once more. And then find out what's the deal with the butterflies. Why haven't I? I mean, at least in this region, do I have to build? Do I have to wait until I got a few more tons or it's like I have to breed every butterfly in existence then let them, you know, mingle amongst themselves or maybe it's something like, oh yeah, you gotta have three butterflies or you have this butterfly in near these and these trees. And so maybe it gets together. This is the crater where our dead friend Cyanodan has built his or wanted to build his launch platform. However, the Iridium asteroid is gone. It was a giant iridium that maybe... I mean, now there's minerals, so I'm not sure, but those are probably just 
if the area has minerals allowed they get automatically generated there's his hidden base over there there's my hidden base over here oh yeah there, 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 there was this base and over there is the seal like cave the temple of doom and oh good grief there's no teleporter here all right i'm heading back i'm gonna have a look around see what's up story we didn't i mean we, we see all saw some new stuff so another one of those meteorites coming down that's nice the giant iridium asteroid is gone. There are my trees. And well, sadly that's it. I didn't found any I haven't found any wild butterflies. Well maybe I need to just have more butterflies and farms around so they can, you know evolve and mutate and spread around new species but this all and more when i know more next time so stay safe and bye bye small addendum i was jetting around for some thumbnails and i found something that i haven't found in the last updates the elusive golden block a uh, box i'm a such a blockhead there. Hi. Boing. Yeah. Uh, up here on the. Oh, good grief! My ankle, my ankle, my ankle! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Ooh, on one of these overhangs, looking towards. Ooh, hello. There's a mushroom cave. Cliffhanger. Mushrooms. <laughs>